What is going on guys? This is Amal from Tech Other Craft. In this video, I'm going to be going to Twit Studios. I'm trying to do something a little different here with a little vlog style. We'll see how that goes. But um, mostly I'm going to go see Leo Laporte, Megan Maroney, and Jason Howell. Hopefully run into some other people maybe too. Basically, Leo is the OG tech guy. He's been around since the 90s, 80s, maybe even before that. But um, I actually found him in like early 2000s, late 90s doing tech tv but basically he has his own studio now where well, they do mostly podcasts but what's cool is they do produce video so i actually end up watching them on youtube most of the time they do shows like ios today mac break weekly uh windows weekly all about android uh, even uh, like uh, some really deep shows like this week in tech and this week in google I really enjoyed if you guys are interested in some deeper youtube content that is actually more than just b-roll and and fancy you know product reviews uh, they do have some of that too though but they actually have some nice depth in their discussion anyway guys I'm gonna try to head over there and get some selfies or video or something I don't know we'll see what happens Um, I love your stuff. It is amazing and um, I can't also wait to see your vegan stuff. This is Security Now with Steve Gibson. Episode 704, recorded Tuesday, March 5th, 2019. Okay, and then do you think that there is really a chance of a robot apocalypse, no. <laughs> artificial intelligence no. taking over at all. And I'll tell you why. Okay. Um, AI, people always assume it's going to be like the Terminator. AI is going to uh, basically go from being able to drive a car to having a mind, a consciousness. And I think that that's a, actually a giant leap. Now, I don't know what makes consciousness. I guess you could, if you're very mechanistic, say, well, you get enough mind, enough thinking going, at some point it develops consciousness. But I don't ever think our AIs will become conscious, which is good news because they'll do the things we want them to do, follow the rules we give them, but at no point will they develop their own will. And I just don't think that's going to happen. I don't think that will, mind, and consciousness are just lots of thinking faster and faster and faster. In fact, we know our brain isn't all that fast. It's massively parallel, but it's not all that fast. What makes us conscious, make, you don't have to be religious or spiritual to say this. You might be, that would certainly be one way to say it, but what makes us a conscious mind is not just the cognition that goes on here, but it's everything. It's our liver, it's our heart, it's our cells, it's the whole mass of it. And I honestly don't think we know, we don't even know what process creates love or fear or hope we, far from we don't even understand it let alone writing a computer program that will do it so no i'm i think that that's um, a mistake to assume that super fast efficient thinking computers will ever get mind consciousness or will and of course you'd have to have will to want to kill us <laughs> awesome all right guys that's leo the original tech reviewer that's steve before youtube came out into being <laughs> well, I'm ignoring. he was the real tech yeah reviewer. before youtube that's <laughs> right. how old i am <laughs> anyway thank you so much thanks leo. thanks for the leather goods <laughs>